Hello everybody, I hope you are doing well. In this video, I'd like to show you a UAV scenario created using Mininet Wi-Fi and Kofalia SIM or VREP. So let's start. First of all, you need to install and open VREP. So let's do that. Open it in a terminal. Here we need to type dot bash Kofalia SIM edge. The Kofalia SIM is opening. Please wait just a second. Okay, then uh, we need to open the Mininet Wi Fi folder and uh, then examples and then UAV folder. Uh, you can see here there is a file install and we need to install this file. Uh, you know, um, let's do that. Okay, open it in a terminal and here we need to type sudo dot dash install the dot okay it's installing while it's installing let me show you what this file contains you can see it's checking the releases of the operating system uh, that it can be uh, 20.10, 20.04, 18.0, other versions. Um, you know, here you can replace the number of release you want, and then it downloads the Kavalia um, SIM for Ubuntu 18, and this is for uh, 16. So let's see what happens. Okay, where is that? Here. It's downloading the files. We have to wait a few minutes, so let's wait. Okay, while it's uh, downloading the files, let me show you the next step. The next step, you know, uh, we need to run this Python file uav.py and, uh, uh, you know, uh, this can start Mininet Wi-Fi and the simulation in Kofalia SIM and it starts a remote API capturing the positions of the drones in simulation in parallel. And, uh, you know, it shows a Mininet Wi-Fi graph, which is used to observe the node positions, the signal range. I'll show you in... Okay, it finished. And uh, here we need to uh, run that file. UAV.py Okay, as I told you, it opened the Kofalia SIM and the Mininet Wi-Fi graph here. Okay, no problem. You can see they are running in parallel and here, the drones are moving in the Kofalia SIM and you can capture the area using the front and floor camera. And here in Mininet Wi-Fi graph, you can see the drones are moving around and you can capture the signal, the position of the drones. Let me show you the fuller here. Just a second. okay and you can see the position drone number one drone number two drone number three and you can capture them and uh, here after installing the Kofalia SIM this folder was added to the uh, uh, UAV folder and uh, the remote API 
so okay and let me tell you an important point if there is an error to connect it to the Kapalaya sim socket you can run this command and you know it's uh, using to kill the process by name and if Kapalaya sim continues running after finishing with an Wi-Fi execution you can stop it and run the uh, comment below thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed